Well, in season five, she was recently widowed and really, I think, in a state of shock. And so I think her face in question, her everything that she's known is in question. Um, but she's determined to absorb some of the Lizzie that Douglas made her, um, not just to go back to being Elizabeth Bly. So she's got this constant, who do I need to be in this situation? Do I need to be Lizzie or do I need to be Elizabeth? And I suppose at the beginning of season six, she just doesn't know what the hell to do with herself. You know, she's spent like, we should do, she spends a year in mourning and she just decides that she can't go on like this anymore and and has what they call the makeover, I call it a make under because to me it's about stripping away the old Elizabeth and seeing what's underneath. Um, so she has something of an epiphany about what it actually was that Douglas gave her and how valuable that was. She also refuses to interfere. Ash Park has a new mistress. I never guessed how hard it would be until it was. <laughs> she calls herself Switzerland. She takes no sides, um, which is a whole new trip for her. What does or doesn't happen is no longer my affair. So it's a time of, you know, going to rock bottom and then can't climbing from the ashes. And I think she certainly does. And Lizzie starts creeping back in. And if any of you hear me worrying about George and Sarah, feel free to pull me up. They're forging a new life and they don't need me in constant commentary. I remember saying to Bevan, please don't kill her. There's got to be something more interesting for a 60-something-year-old woman to do than die in a series. And I think I don't deserve to die. A Place to Call Home, the final season. Sunday, 8.30 on Showcase or stream on demand.